Okay. Right, let's start the shit. Oh my god, it's learning land. Spring cleaning. No fucking way. Spring cleaning. Oh my god. Hiya. Hello. My name is Millie. Hello, Millie. It's jolly nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you too. Before I introduce you to the rest of the gang, you'll need to make a name tag <laughs> so that everyone knows who you are. Okay. What's your name? Uh, Enter your first oh, okay. <laughs> name by clicking the letters on the screen. If you click on the Oh my god! <laughs> don't worry, just click here. <gasps> oh! Rub out the letter you just The nostalgia! Said. When you're finished, click on the green tip. I remember this. If you're stuck, click, click on me. Oh my god! Right, my name's Queen Creeps. I don't know if that will actually fit into the bar. E. E N C. I should really just put. <laughs> I should really just put Queen, shouldn't I? Because yeah, I, I don't feel very evil today, so I'm just E P. Oh my god, it fit. Okay, done. Oh, and you got to choose a little tag. I remember this. Um. Oh yeah, and they have the Queen thing here. What your name tag will look like. Brilliant. Click here if you want to choose a different picture. Oh, why would I? Click here if you're happy with your name tag. I mean, I could choose this penguin here or. Nah, let's just carry on. That's it. Next time you come to Learning Land, click on your name tag. And you can start <laughs> playing right away. I cannot believe this. Tidying up to do. Come and give us a hand. Yeah. Hi there. Hello. We're all in my garage. Oh my god, it's my Biff! Spring. And he's dressed as Lucas from Mother 3. It's not even spring. It doesn't have to be spring. Wow, right, I'm yeah, guessing this is like the 12th game in the series. So the animation's so much better than the first few games. Need to get everything packed up ready. It's okay though, Biff, because you'll be moving to a house near me. Isn't that right? Because, like, if you see in the earlier games, it looks like everything's drawn in fucking MS Paint! <laughs> so, um, should I wait until they stop talking? Nah. What's in this box? I bet it's all Bib's nature books. It's full of old photos. So this is the only disc I could find. Um... And I, I do remember this game. <laughs> so I'll talk about the characters in a sec after they all like stop talking. All oh, the voice acting. I remember that toy train. I used to play with it every day. Oh, the eyes just like burn into your soul. <laughs> How long does this go on for? Again. Yeah, spider. Oh, look, a spider! Kill it! Eek! A spider! <laughs> wow! Okay, the fucking it's animation! <laughs> it's probably more scared of you. I think spiders are icky. I don't like them. Yeah. Yeah. Spiders <laughs> run away. It's safe to come down now. Actually, I like it up here. It means I'm the tallest for a change. Tim, you're so tall. I can hardly see you up there. You're not even looking at him. Are you going to help us tidy up Biff's garage? Oh, do I have to? Look around to help clean up. You'll find lots oh, oh, of games okay. and surprises too. Yeah, I know how to play Learning Land. Right, let me explain. This is Biff here. This garage hasn't been cleaned for ages. Oh, whatever. Um, <laughs> for God's sake, stop talking. So Biff. Uh, no, stop talking! <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Bugs make their homes in lots oh, right. Places. Click on me to find out all about them. Yeah, okay, so the, there's like the different characters, and that's Biff here. And he talks about nature and all that. He teaches you about nature. Sue teaches you about sort of um, life choices and all that, and just life in general. Tim's maths, the little mouse there, and Millie's English. So let's start with oh, Millie. Biff. Oh, I don't even care. Let's go. Let's go. Whoa, what is this? I think I remember this. Hiya, 
Hello. The most moving house today, and the removal truck needs to find its way to his new house. Oh, he look at that MS Paint he stuff. The artwork. Do I just have to click it? Between the house that Biff lives in now and his new house has all the letters. Oh, you've got to fill in the missing letter. I get it. Oh my god, I should probably have done this with like somebody else, but. Oh god, let's see how the animation's gonna be for this. <laughs> when it gets to an empty space, you must find the letter that's missing. Yeah, I, I think I get the picture. <laughs> Been a new. God, when you're like older and you play this. It's just so fucking boring just listening to the explanation. When you're a kid, you just don't give a shit. Oh, yay! Oh, the jiggle jigsaw! Okay, so this is the difficulty. Oh, I'm feeling like fucking Einstein and Lily. <laughs> Millie, not Lily. Oh, 12. What a big number. Right. Okay, we're off. Let's go. Let's not fall into the holes. I'm pretty sure this is not how, like, deliveries work. Alphabet Street. Maybe I should have picked 8, actually. Yeah, it's C. So good. I'm, this is just the first one. Oh, I love those little Best ducks. They're so cute. She's one of Biff's friends. Jill. I don't care. <laughs> but you just, you just give me the answer now. <laughs> oh, why did I choose 12? Oh, good to know. Fuck's sake. When I move to Kent and, um... Ice Verno comes to visit. I'm making him play this game, I swear to God. Yeah, go, Mr. Lorry Driver. Listen to a little five year old tell you what to do. No shit. Uh, yes. I know my fucking alphabet. Come on, I want that piece of the fucking jiggle jigsaw. You don't have to keep going E. I, I can't. I don't know if the little recorder thing here is going to show up on the actual recording, but I can't actually see the letters. <laughs> oh yay! Oh my god! We're already eight minutes in. Jesus Christ! Um. Oh, what is it? Um. L. Where's L? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I know! I know! Oh my god, Millie, you're so annoying! Oh no, shit! Uh, it's N. There's a cinema down there. Let's go and see the cinema. This actually reminds me of when um I drew like a map of a town in like year seven in um, high school and I couldn't fit all the stuff on the map so I had to like cram it all in. It just looks like that, like everything's so crammed in together. <laughs> Jesus Christ, um, this is O isn't it? Yeah, O. Oh, I know. Yeah, well, it's taking. We're already been like five minutes on this, love. Look, there's the football pitch where Biff plays kickabout with his friends. Kickabout! Quick! Find the missing letter so that the Quick. truck can drive on. Quick! Wait, we've been timed! Okay. Hooray! Here we go again! Oh, Millie was like my favourite as a kid, but at the same time, she's just so fucking annoying now. Oh, good to know! Oh my god. Oh, 
Stop talking! You all talk so much! See, the case I found before, I had I found a case to like um another game and it was mealtime and that was my favourite game and the disc wasn't even in it! Yes, I can! Oh good, there's only one more after this. Go. Drive! Oh my god, sweet. I hate sweets. Oh no, what's this? A hole in Alphabet Street. In See, it's not letters. rocket science. If the letters were like jumbled up, then I think this would have like more of a challenge. But no, there's nothing. Go, drive. God sake. Oh, we did it! Yay! At last. It looks the exact same as this other house! Ha! Th those are his belongings, it's like some blocks. Why is the truck driving back? We're not doing that all over again, are we? If, if we have to do this all over again, guys, I swear to god. <laughs> I'm gonna have to like split this into parts, aren't I? There you go, Dark Shadow V. You wanted me to do Let's Play, so I'm doing them. Are you happy now? <laughs> go on, drive up. There we go. The truck's ready to leave with its second load. Oh my! Okay, we're off. Why are they all capital letters? Oh, fuck's sake, I might have to skip this, because this is so boring, but I want that fucking piece of the Jiggle Jigsaw. Quick, find the missing letter so that the truck can drive on. Why? Why? You filled the hole! Hooray! We're off again! Like, as in, why does my life have any meaning? Why am I playing this game? Because other YouTubers are playing it, so I'm playing it too. There we go. We're there! Right, is that it now? You filled all the letter holes in alphabet. Yay! You can fill a jiggle hole too with this that, piece that sounds of dirty. Star. Fuck yeah. I know. Let's sing the alphabet together. Uh, do we have to? A, B, C, C, D, D, okay. e, e, F, G, H, I, J, K, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S. T U V W X Y and Z. Uh, I don't fucking think so, love. Welcome to the jiggle, the jigsaw that makes you giggle. Oh my god! It's already completed. You've got a jiggle piece ready to be put into position. So the whole point of this is that go away, pop up. Um, then drag it into place. The whole point of this is that what what's it doing? Okay. Is that you get CDs, you got CDs every week, I explained this at the beginning, but you got CDs like every week. And um, it would sort of like remember on each disc um, which ones you filled in. So obviously I've played the ones beforehand because it's remembered the other ones I did back when I was a kid. And all you do is just fill it in like this. And then when you fill the whole thing in, that something good right. will happen. Good work. And I actually remember what happens here, but I I'm not going to tell you because spoilers. Okay, let's go back. Hey there. Hello. We're still in Biff's garage getting ready for Biff moving house. Uh, well, no shit. We found all sorts of funny things hidden in these boxes. <laughs> Look what I found. God, the animation's actually not too bad. I don't care. Aww, <laughs> very little bit. And now he's very fat. <laughs> I know. I get into this Screw place. this, let's play with Tim. We go. Tim... Wait. See, I actually liked Tim's stuff because he always talked about food, actually. Uh, I feel very dumb today, to be honest. Yeah, the only reason I'm choosing blue, by the way, guys, is because, like, that just took forever, the last one, so let's just do it more easier. I'll choose two things from Biff's garage. Then... I'll ask you to tell me either which is the heavier or which is the lighter. A ton of bricks or a ton of feathers. Oh, check out that radio. Time to 
weigh them. The scales will weigh them in kilograms. When you kilograms. Scales, God. The arrow will move Who in the UK weighs in kilograms anymore? This box weighs three kilograms. I don't care! If you finished your weighing, I'll ask you to tell me either which is the heavier or which is the lighter. Mm. Then you just click on the correct answer. And okay. The choice is here. If you get six weighing puzzles right, I'll give you a piece of the jiggle jigsaw. Yay! Jiggle jigsaw! Is the heavier. Click and drag the things. Oh, stop talking! Learning land where they all fucking talk too much. This weighs four kilograms. Okay. Um, how much does the other one weigh? This weighs three kilograms. How the fuck does the car weigh more than the lamp? Drag the objects to the scales one at a time. Weigh them. Now, which of these things is the heavier? That's right. Now, <laughs> oh, look at that dinosaur! The Who the fuck made these like little models? This weighs four kilograms. Jesus Christ! And how much does this keyboard weigh? This weighs three kilograms. Oh, I wonder which one's the heavier. Now, which of these things is the lighter? Oh, lighter. That one. Well, Dude, I feel so fucking smart. Which of these things is the <laughs> what? Is that a teddy bear? <laughs> what is that? This weighs one kilogram. <laughs> I've never seen a teddy bear look like that before, I swear. This weighs five kilograms. I thought that was a sandcastle. Now, which of these things is the lighter? I wonder what. Correct. Now, which of these things is the heavier? Click and drag the things to the scales one at a time. What does this say when I click this? This game is all about weighing objects to find out which is the heaviest and which is the lightest. Nice! Okay, this is one kilogram, isn't it? This weighs one kilogram. And what was this one? Three. This weighs three kilograms. I'm so now, hungry. <laughs> which of these things is the heavier? Uh, this one. Well done. Now. So, Tim was the youngest, and I think Sue's the oldest. So Tim's the one who's always a bit shy, and so like, oh, I'm small and all this. And then Sue's the one who acts like the grown-up. But, oh god, like, they, the other ones actually all sound like kids, but then Sue's like, well done, I knew you could do it. And she had, like, in the, was it the second game? No, it was the third game, I think. Yeah, at the fun fair. She had the best game, it was like this fucking board puzzle thing. I mean, that game was the shit as a kid. Sorry, I've been rambling. Uh, sorry, this is like childhood, okay? It's nostalgia. Oh, no shit, Sherlock. Have you? The dinosaur! Right, last one. Oh, it's a duck! I love ducks. I have a duck called Chica. It's not actually Chica from Final Freddy's, but I just called it Chica. Noise. Now, which of these things is the lighter? The duck. That's right. Congratulations. We did it. Way out winner. Way out winner. Dude, give me that jiggle jigsaw piece. Yeah. Get in. No. Great to see you again. Hey, Biff. Look. Oh, that monkey's so creepy. He's ready to be put into position. See if you can work out where it goes. Well, I would if you'd let me do it. Then drag it into place. Drag it into place. There we go. That's it. Well done. Should now we just call Biff Lucas? Find another jiggle piece. Let's Biff. let's go and Biff play Biscuit. Let's go on a bug hunt. A bug hunt. Hello there. Uh bugs. Hey Hudo, you creeped me. out yet? <laughs> I'm going to use my magnifying glass. Oh, you nerdy little kid. So he's trying to show, oh, look at me with my magnifying glass. Insects and other bugs that we're going to find out about. Oh. Can I show you a close-up of one of these Oh, this is like, he talks about nature and he's such a nerd. So, this is just going to be all really boring. Eight bugs right, I'll give you a Eight! Okay, let's play big bugs. Uh. Here is the first bug. 
I might just skip this entire thing. You're looking at that one. That's Garrett Beetle? Oh, Woodlouse. That's not Woodlouse. Woodlouse has seven pairs of legs. That's 14 altogether. What a big number. It lives under rocks and in damp places. Nam, you should do this everything wrong with learning land. It rolls into a ball. Oh, this is gonna take forever. Okay. Can you tell me which bug this is? Yeah. They didn't even give us a difficulty level, they just like, yeah, just do it. It's a, green fly. a what? The green What's a green fly? Is a bit oh, he's gonna tell us now. Uh, a bit of a pest. Such as cabbages, potatoes, Dude, stop talking about food, I'm hungry! It is a favorite snack My sister's gonna come over in a bit and think, what the hell am I doing? Now, can you tell me which bug it is? It's a bee, I used to be terrified of these as a kid. I kind of still am, but not too bad. This honeybee lives with many other honeybees uh -huh. in a home called a hive. Ooh. It's Vespaquen or Combi. Collecting a sweet tasting food called nectar that is turned into honey in the hive. Oh, nice. I love honey. Here's another. Now, is that an ant? It's an earwig. That's an earwig. An earwig likes to come out at night. It cannot fly. Earwigs were called earwigs because people thought that they crawled into your ears. Oh! Yeah. But that's not true. Oh. They are completely harmless to us. Oh, good. <laughs> okay. Can you tell me which bug this is? Is it this one? What's this? It's a fly. No shit. Oh, I hate that noise. <laughs> the house fly has two wings, a hairy body, and six hairy legs. Oh, that's disgusting. The end of each leg is a foot with a sticky pad. Now, now I'm getting more of an in-depth description. I can kind of understand now why my friend Hudo hates insects. <laughs> They're carrying the dirt to food. Ew! Did you know? A fly can taste food through its feet as well as its mouth. Uh, I didn't know. I thought it was like they threw up on their food and drank it up because they can't actually eat. What could this be? That's a grasshopper. It's a grasshopper. Oh god. See, alternative universe where Lucas is just a hippo rhino thing. Hippo. By rubbing its legs or back wings. Against other parts of its body. I knew that. Many grasshoppers have their Oh ears stop talking! Legs. What a funny place to put them. <laughs> if I could jump as much as a grasshopper, I'd be able to leap over my Look at his hands. hands. Although I can't I can't really say much because like I don't even draw you fingers on my pieces. <laughs> uh this one. Dragonfly? It's a dragonfly. Yeah! Oh, that noise! The dragonfly likes to live around ponds. Really? It catches smaller flies with its six <sighs> as it buzzes above the water. Nice to know. There have been dragonflies on Earth since the time of the dinosaurs. Oh, it's a dinosaur! Were huge. It's Alphys with wings! Dinosaurs. Actually, it does look like it with little glasses and stuff. Here's the last bug. Is this an ant? It's an ant. An ant. <laughs> likes to work in a team. I know. Collecting leaves and seeds. Hmm? It lives in a group called a colony. Ooh, nice. Is an insect with six legs. Some ants also have wings for flying, <laughs> but not this one. That's eight bugs you've looked at. Yay! We're so smart. Piece of the jiggle jigsaw. <laughs> <laughs> that music! If you'd like to look up I'm definitely not playing more of that. Game. Hello again. Look, you've got a jiggle piece ready to be put into position. See what kid's gonna know what the word position means? Then drag it into place. Hmm. I wonder where it could go. Whatever. <laughs> Fit. Yeah! Nice one. Right, I think Sue's one is where you talk about like ages. 
There's only one more piece of the jiggle jigsaw left to find. Sweet. Let's do it soon. Oh yeah, it's like um you have to order all the pictures. Hello. I've been having great fun looking through Biff's photos. Wow, they all look totally like Biff, so don't they? And some of him in nappies when he was a tiny baby. See, Sue just doesn't sound like a kid. I've always felt like me inside, but the way I look on the outside is different from when I was a baby. What the fuck? I wonder what I look like when I grow up. You'll look like a cat. In fact, you only live for about 15 years or 20 years, so meh. I've got six pictures here. I'd like you to sort them out. Okay. the picture of the youngest person first. Can we do it now? Oh no, come. And the oldest person last. Just click on the pictures. Well, there's two babies. How do we know which one's which? Remember, place them in order from the youngest to the oldest. If you put all the pictures in the right places, I'll give you a piece of the jiggle jigsaw. Fuck yeah. Okay. Stick the photos in the album. Why are they all girls? <laughs> See, what I think, um... I actually kind of remember what she says. I remember, like, when she says about a teenage, so, like, it's a funny age, you know, because you're not a child anymore, but you're not a grown-up either. And I'm just like, fuck off. Right, I'm guessing this one's the youngest. Into the right place. Yeah, toddler. That's right. Can you put another picture into uh, the right place? Yeah, what do you think I'm doing? Well done. When I grow up, I want to be a princess or a doctor a or princess. a teacher or a scientist. I haven't decided yet. You can't be a princess unless you're born into the royal family or you get married to someone. Even then you don't get to be a princess, you'd be a duchess. God. Into the right place. Oh, do I have to? That's right. Can you put another picture into the right place? Yeah, whatever. Did it. Correct. I think that's the easiest of Sue's games. Well you put all of the that was so fucking easy. Now sit back and listen to what they have to say. Oh yeah, little fuck fun. Oh, poor baby. Babies can't do anything for themselves. What's <laughs> mean? <laughs> they need someone to feed them, rest them, and look after them all the time. Yeah! <laughs> it's just Sue trying to do the voices. <laughs> Babies soon learn to walk. When they do, we call them toddlers because they toddle about. Oh, no shit. Hello, I'm five. Hello, I'm five. We're five. Young when we're five. <gasps> But we're old enough to go to school. I love everyone's oh yeah, everyone's back at school now. Even though I'm only little. Yeah, I remember it. Hi! Oh my god, you make it sound so emo. You're called a teenager from when you're 13 until you're 19. I'm a teenager then. Because you're not a child anymore, but you're not a grown-up either. Oh that's good right. When you're Hello young, there. <laughs> you can do almost anything you like. You can be a teacher or a technically I'm an adult. Come on. Or both if you want to. It's up to you. Hello there, little. Why is she winking? This lady is a grandmother. So doctor. Her children have grown up and have children of their own. Uh, maybe she doesn't have children. She is grown up. If you'd like to hear about any of the people again, click on their picture or click above the photo album to carry on. Wait, there's more. Now that you've met all of the people in the album, I can give you your piece of the jiggle jigsaw. At last. Thank you. Click on the photo album if you'd like to play again. Why would you? Welcome back. Hey again. Look, you've got a oh, it's a butterfly. Dude, that's me. <laughs> See if you can work out where it goes, then drag it into place. Did none of you know that I'm half butterfly? Well, now you know. That looks right. Good work. I love this little animation that happens. This part of the jiggle picture is finished. Hell yeah. Now it's time to explore. Try clicking on the picture and see what happens. And don't forget, there will be four more jiggle pieces to find in the next issue of Learning Land. Yay! So like you got the magazine, the CD came with it free. And then this animation would happen if you finished the whole picture. 
I told you they were here. Remember the panther waking up. Gosh. Why are the kids just on their own in a fucking jungle? I know a hippo song, Sue. Listen. Mud. Mud. Glorious mud. There's nothing quite like it for cooling the blood. What? <laughs> cooling the blood? You're not such a nature know it's all after all. Oh, Sue. I was messing about. You are a cheeky monkey. <laughs> no, Biff. That's a cheeky monkey. <laughs> oh, that panther. Oh, no. We've woken the panther. We'd better get out of here. Do you think the panther will follow us home, Biff? No, Sue. He doesn't know the way. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We can click on stuff. That'd be my little theme song when I just like start my videos. It's cute. It's creepy. Did he even do anything? It's like, yeah. Don't drown the bird. Wait, what was that? I've never known a crocodile to make that noise. Wow. Those eyes. What? Tukan. I don't think that's it. What does this do? To go back to the gang. Oh. They're all staring at me. What do I do? So I can click on stuff. Because we did all this and then we could do the mask thing. And that's it. What the hell is this? Oh, this is like... You've come to the right place to find out what's on the Learning Land CD-ROMs. Right. When you put the discs in... Find out what's on the next issue of Learning Land, yeah, when you put the disc in, there. it will record, right. like, what games you played. To find out what we're all going to be doing. You can also find out what's on this issue of Learning Land by clicking here. Oh, I forgot about this part. Right, what is the next one, then? Oh my god, it's like done in a story. I've not played anything else, apparently. Right. Number, is number three the fun fair, or is that? And this is what happens if you didn't play it. I don't think you played this issue of learning right? Bitch, I played this one all the time. If you have it, you'll need to quit this CD-ROM and put the new CD-ROM into your CD-ROM drive. If not, ask a grown-up <laughs> to look in the inside front cover of a Learning Lad magazine. For order information, yeah! How many of these were there? I'm guessing that's it. 11. What's 11? Putting on a shirt. Do not remember that one. What else is that? They're just staring at me. Let's do this. Oh, the fun station! Oh, I remember this! Yeah! I forgot about this one! I thought it was just making the mask! I didn't know it was like a different one each time! Pooch. I think this is where I like found my love for animation as a kid. When you click on one of the pictures here, something happens to Pooch. If you want to record what happens to Pooch, just click on the record button. Oh my god. Click on any pictures. You can click on as many pictures as you like during your two minute cartoon. Two minutes. When you finish making your cartoon, Click on the stop button here, and then on the playback button here. Okay. You'll be able to watch your crazy pooch cartoon all over again. Here comes pooch. Just click on the record button to record your cartoon. Okay. 
Right. So in each one, they'd have this thing called the fun station. And I thought on each one, it was just making the mask. I completely forgot about this one. Um, but sometimes what you could do is that you could make like a picture or something like that. Or you could make a mask and you could print it off. You know, if you little old printers that will take like half an hour to print off. And I used to just waste the ink in my Nan's printer from doing it. Right. Let's start. Let's do all of them. Oh, that gale force. What the fuck? That's really creepy. Mind the ladder! Mind the ladder. <laughs> you can tell, like, just how much I remember this. Go up those steps, pooch! <laughs> that animation. I think I always used to click on that to see if I could actually hit him. I like walking. It keeps me tick -tock, doggy fit. Oh, that's what Pooch sounds like, is it? Sounds a bit like Teddy, doesn't it? Oh, I am Teddy! <laughs> Law, you're getting rained on. I don't want to get rained on, you bitch! Oh, You're actually going to fall down the hole. What the actual- he's gonna fall down now, isn't he? D Jesus Christ, did he just die? Stop! You must wait for the green light! Oh god, has two minutes gone by already? And one more. Watch out. And stop! Well that was fun, wasn't it? Should, should we really watch it back? No, let's go back because I think that's it now. Let's cob with him. <laughs> well, I think that was very fun. Let's go now. Are you sure you want to leave Learning Land? Oh god, it's like her voice is just like, "Don't leave. You can never leave this hell." Carry on playing. I think um, as some of you know. My personality split into Queen and Creeps, and at the moment, it's Queen talking, so... I honestly think that Creeps would just be like, when- <laughs> She's just like little, like little kids to like play this, and she'd be like, No, you're never leaving this hellhole. <laughs> mm. We're never letting Creeps play one of these games, okay? Right, let's go. Oh, the music! Da -da 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 -da. Bye. The animation. <laughs> and that's it. Thank you so much, guys, for um watching this video. I'm gonna have to go and edit a lot of it now because it was a bit, you know, patchy some places. I mean, fucking Millie's game. Oh my god. But yeah, I, I really much enjoyed myself. Um, when I go to uni in, in, a, in like this week, basically, um, I'm going to order more of these games and get my friends to play it. And we will have more episodes of Learning Land, hopefully in future. So thank you so much for watching. This has been Queen or Queen Creeps or whatever you want to call me. And I shall see you next time. So yeah, bye bye.